Hello, and welcome to episode one of Planetoids. Okay, this is a, a very strange place, to be certain. And just so you know, this is not the Windows 10 edition. We are playing the standard PC edition. Uh, this map I downloaded, it was um, done by a man, or I assume it's a man, it could be a woman, uh, a user named Sea Turtle 5 I got it off the Minecraft forums website. Uh, there's a generation tool that creates these maps. Um, this one is a 16 by 16 chunk. There's about 400 or so planets within in here that we're going to be working with. Um, I believe this was a version 1.5 maybe um, of Minecraft and so we're not going to have absolutely all of the different block types within it but I am playing this in um, the uh, 1.10 edition of Minecraft. I just imported it in that way and uh, that way I could use my Optifine and whatnot with it and and let's see what we can do. I'm not certain. How much we're going to be able to get done in this series. Um, it depends upon, you know, what we have available to us, how long it takes us to get the resources. Um, each world, I think, has different items in its core. This one looks like it might be all dirt. Um, you gotta be careful you don't want to go down too far because well then you're gonna wind up falling into the void which is definitely not something we want to do so let me kind of just uh, build this out a little bit looks like we've got some desert down there there's some stone I don't want to kill off all my grass digging up the top area because um, I want to try to see if we can get something maybe where we can uh, spawn some uh, um, cows and pigs and sheep and stuff like that, chickens, um, and they need a, like a grassy area to spawn on. So I'm just going to kind of extend this out a little bit as carefully as I can without falling into the void. And I probably should have left that open so I can get back down in the middle. Okay, so let's see. We'll, we'll kind of clear out this second layer a bit. Get some of this dirt. Now again, this is... Um, an older version of Minecraft initially so I don't think we're gonna find anything like a like the end portal or anything like that so we're probably not gonna be able to go to the end in order to go to the nether we'll have to get lava and water we do have um, a planet over there that had water on it, so we should be okay there. There's several of them, and there's probably one nearby that also would have um, lava. We just have to go look for it. Um, we don't have any saplings, so wood's going to be a challenge here. Probably should have started this off with the bonus chest. Don't know if I could have or not. Maybe we at least had a few saplings. Let me go ahead and take this top layer off since it's just kind of expanding outside. We 
need to do is find ourselves a planetoid that's close by that has some trees growing on it of some sort so that we can get some wood and get started. Otherwise, well, we're not going to be able to get far and do anything without wood. That's your, you know, base component that you need for every Minecraft world. Otherwise, you can't make tools. And you can't mine. You can't do anything. So, just be a waste of time. So, let me uh, continue digging this out. And I'll be back with you soon. Okay, so what I think we ought to do is probably need to build out this direction a bit and uh, get some of this glowstone. It's going to be night soon and, well, we're going to have all kinds of monsters spawning out here. If we don't have this lit up, we unfortunately have no sheep, so we have no wool, so we can't uh, uh, make a bed and sleep through the night. So we've got to do something here. So let me... See if I can back out this way carefully. I'm not liking walking backwards off the edge of these blocks, but that is what is necessary to do in order to get where we're going. Like we've got a creeper down there below us on that planet. Okay. safer platform here. Make sure I'm going the right way. Okay. Get some glowstone here. Five pieces of glowstone. Let's carefully walk our way back across. All right, let's see if we can light this up a bit. We'll just. Ah, oh, goody. All right. Grab my glowstone. side of my planetoid here. Get yourself a little barricade here just in case. Slide up down below as well. I think we should be fairly safe. We do have that huge glowstone planet there to help shed some light on us. Let's see over here, off in this direction. Oh, no, that's just some dirt. I thought I saw a zombie over there. But we did see that creeper down below. my dirt block. Every little bit's going to count in this world it looks like, so let's go ahead and dig out some more and see if we can make it through the night and then we'll just figure out what we're going to do going forward. Okay, well the next thing I decided to do is start traversing out towards this water 
planetary that we have over here um, because we're going to need it. I did manage to get a few seeds from the grass that was growing out here. Unfortunately, without wood, again, um, I can't make a hoe to plant the seeds because uh, I could probably just poke a hole in the glass here, you know, put some dirt up, poke a hole in the glass uh, so the water would come in and then we could um, start farming a bit. Um, I really, really need to find something here. Looks like there's some sugar cane up there. But I need to find a planetoid that has some trees on it. At least one. If not, we're not going to get very far. And I may have to just cheat one in. And that's not something I really want to do. Um, but otherwise, uh, this isn't going to be a very fun series. Because we're not going to be able to do anything. We're not going to be able to sleep. We're not going to be able to eat. And we're just going to be kind of running around in circles doing absolutely nothing. So, let me know in the comments what you think I should do. I could restart the series and see if I can get a bonus chest in here. Um, just reload the map. That might be something to do. Um, if it's okay with you, I could just uh, cheat in a couple of saplings. Um, just so we could get started. Um, and we'll deal with what we have uh, as far as the three seeds that I managed to find along the way. Um, and we can continue from there. But again, without wood, we're not going to get anywhere in this series. So anyways, I think that's going to be it for now. If you like what you've seen here, please feel free to thumbs it up. Uh, and also, please feel free to subscribe. So until next time, this is Desert Rat. Have a good one. Goodbye.